sub YouTube soon. Oh, luckier. And today, we're going to be opening one of the rarest Yu-Gi-Oh products ever made. It is the Master Collection Volume 2. You guys, this thing is straight crazy. It is so nostalgic. There's six booster packs inside with six cards. And you guys are thinking, yeah, but I see those Master Collection Volume 1 opened, you know, here and there. No, no, no. This is Master Collection Volume 2, you guys. I just want to clarify. This is Volume 2. This is one of the rarest and best Yu-Gi-Oh! products. Um, I feel like out of all the Yu-Gi-Oh! products that have slowly just increased in price over the years, this guy has always been pretty expensive. I remember looking for this, looking for this product for you guys sealed a few years ago. And it was still around a few hundred dollars. Now it's kind of in that $500,000 range just because everything's going up. But still, this product hasn't increased that much. Um, this is Master Collection, volume to you guys. We're doing a massive giveaway for this video. We're actually going to have six different winners for this giveaway. All you guys have to do is like this video and comment below which is your favorite Master Collection, volume one or volume two. And yes, we're talking about English TCG. Um, so for the giveaway though, guys, we're going to be giving away each different pack inside of here. doesn't matter what our pulls are. So you're getting all the cards from that pack. Some of you are probably thinking, holy crap. Yeah, holy crap. So when I say we need to pull some godly cards, truly, we need to pull some godly cards. All right, you guys, this is Master Collection Volume 2. I am so excited for this. Um, shout out to the links at the top, you guys. Genesis Impact, finally. Seeing some love, uh, Drytron definitely tier one deck now. Um, the collector's rare slowly kind of rising in price. Um, very cool set, Genesis Impact. Again, I like the live twins. That's just me though. And then the God Box, man. This thing is just pure fire. This is the God Box from Konami. It's the um, three God cards guaranteed every time. And we'll have it in the links at the top. This thing is gonna be so valuable later on. It's crazy. All right, it's time for Master Collection Volume 1, or sorry, Volume 2. Again, for the giveaway, just let us know in the comments below. And uh, we'll be announcing the winners, but we're going to contact the winners as well. But we'll announce them in a future video in a week or two down the road when we do another video that kind of correlates to this. But um, just kind of the same thing we're doing with uh, Risking It All. So you'll see on that video as well. This is it, guys. Master Collection Volume 2. Here we go. Unbelievable. Um, crazy, guys. So when I say we're doing a giveaway, there's a Pharaonic Guardian booster pack. There's a Magician's Force booster pack. One of the few packs that really hasn't been printed very much. Dark Crisis, Invasion of Chaos, Ancient Sanctuary, and Exclusive booster pack. For real, guys. So we're giving away all the cards we pulled from this video. Six different winners, six different booster packs. If I could keep the booster back in good condition, I'll probably just send the cards in the booster pack. But yeah, you guys. And at the top, we're gonna be holding onto these. This is uh, potentially graded cards, but also maybe for a future video. Um, we have Guardian Sphinx, Breaker, Breaker of Magic Warrior, Exodia Necross, Envoy, Black Luster Soldier, Envoy the Beginning. He's just chilling in here, guys. Say what? Black, <laughs> blow, black Blowback Dragon, and then Fiend and the Great Sphinx. So, some of the actually more valuable versions of these cards, you guys. Getting them mint, uh, graded tens. We'll try to show some values for you guys, but I mean, most of them are chilling around the you know five hundred dollar mark if you can get a graded ten. But that's crazy, guys. So this that makes this so valuable. Um, wow, I'm just so excited today to open this up. We also there's going to be more things we're opening in this video, guys. But we're just going to start with this master master collection volume two. We're going to pop off the plastic. Be nice to us. There we go. Okay. All right. 2004, 2005. Man, this is this is classic stuff, guys. Classic stuff. Wow. My wow, little felt, little felt, felt binder there. I'm just gonna take a look at the individual cards here as we open up the booster packs. Our first card is the the Guardian Sphinx. Um, actually playable back in the day if we're playing in a classic format. It is, uh, you can flip this card into face down defense position once per turn during your main phase. 
When this card's flipped face up, return all monsters to the opponent's side of the field to the owner's hand. It's not even face up, it's all monsters. It's actually pretty good. So, but you do have to flip this one because it's not a flip effect. Guardian Sphinx, and we're started off with Pharaonic Guardian, guys. This is gonna be crazy. This is Master Collection Volume 2. One of the rarest Yu-Gi-Oh products, you guys. Currently, this is probably worth more than most of those 2004, 2005 tins. 2002, 2003, you know, they get a little, a little crazy. I'm gonna start things off with a whiff. 2003 booster pack, but 2004 or five product. Here we go. Um, this is six packs, guys. Technically only five. I'm really hoping to pull two foils, maybe one. It's gonna be tough, but let's start strong. Pharaonic Guardian. So this is our first pack that we'll be we'll be giving away here. Again, just post in the comments. Volume one, volume two, maybe saying why will help you. Secret Pass to the Treasures. Dice Jar. Man, but that's actually, that was a crazy card. Potentially doing 6,000 damage. That's crazy. Trap Dust Shoot, one of the best cards in the game. Currently banned. Been banned for a long time. Four more cards in their hand. Look at their hands. Select a monster. Return to the owner's deck. Gravekeeper's Curse. And... Oh, what? Secret Rare Ring of Destruction. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What? That's literally like the best card in the set. Yo. Yo, already godly. Holy crap. Ring of Destruction. Guys, these are 2003 to 2005 blister, uh, booster packs. This is old. This is nostalgic. They have the whiff. Oh my, oh wow, this is great. This is great. Destroy a face-up monster. Inflict direct damage equal to destroy monsters attacked uh, to the life points of both you and your opponent. Wow! Wow, and they changed that, I believe. They are out of that effect, making it not so good, but that's fine. If you're just playing some classic Yu-Gi-Oh, if you're drawn six cards when you go first, you know how good this card is. I don't even know what to do with this. That's crazy talk. This is crazy talk. Oh man. Ring of Destruction, that's what we'll do. We'll set it right on the pack there. That is gonna be a lucky winner right there. Terraforming, Metamorphosis. Guys, this is value, value. Terraforming your card as well. And Trap Dust Shoot, man. Two banned cards, three, well, not anymore, but three extremely good cards, all been banned at one point or another. This is, this is, this is a pack of destiny right here. Servant and Disturbance Strategy, that's a wombo combo card. Wow, guys, what a pack. Ring of Destruction, Metamorphosis, and Trap Dust Shoot. You? you kidding me? Best freaking Pharaoh's Front of Guardian pack I've ever pulled in my life. Oh my gosh. All right, this is how it's gonna be. We need to we need to not do Magician's Force next. If we're gonna have a godly opening like this. Oh, freaking baby. All right, there goes that plastic. Unbelievable, exclusive pack now. We got Great Thenin over there. You guys wanna take a look at him. Crazy cards there. Ooh, looks pretty. MC2 is the set. This is a exclusive pack, guys. Look at that, try to keep that booster in good condition for you. Woo! Sphinx Telia. Telia. Andro Sphinx. Thanon. Return from a different dimension. Inferno Tempest. Familiar Knight. Man, you guys, this is this is memory lane right here. This is the booster pack for the movie. Pete and the Dark Clown and Rare Metal Dragon. Which movie am I talking about? Pyramid of Light. I remember that. Okay, Pyramid of Light, you guys. The exclusive pack that made this pack for the movie. But going to the movie got you the gold movie pack. Um, I think somebody just sold like a thousand of those on eBay. Probably just found them in a room or something. Um, but yeah, yeah but that was the chance at Shining, Blue Eyes Shiny Dragon. Right? Um, but yeah, Sphinx, Sphinxes are in here. This is the uh, guy, the light deck. Ooh, but the uh, Pyramid of Light is not in here. I think that's guaranteed on these, right? Or does it switch up? There might be a ratio of different cards. Can't remember. But still pretty cool, guys. Exclusive pack. Pyramid of Light. That was the, uh, the movie back in the day. And then Return, by the way. Return from a different dimension. 
Um, currently banned, right? Still one of the best cards in the game. Um, pretty cool. And then they had to change the effect of Pete and the Dark Clown a few times. They were like, ah, this is too good. Mistiming, mistiming. So, maybe not change the effect, but just make some rulings. Wow. Okay, guys, this is, this is great. This is fun. Ancient Sanctuary time. I think this is it. This is it. Enemy Controller. Burst Stream. Dark Magic Attack. Secret Rare Cards. Foil Cards. Can't we get a foil? I mean, right now we're... We got a secret red ring of destruction, guys. It's already, we're already winning. We're already godly. This is Master Collection Volume 2. Here we go. Man, if this had Dark Paladin instead of Breaker, imagine that. Imagine that. You can just tell how old these cards are, guys. This is, this is incredible. Leading up to that Christmas special, guys. That's what this is right here. Master Collection Volume 2. The Third Sarcophagus. Emissary of the Oasis. Micro Ray with Goblin Attack Force. Love it. Disc Fighter. Double Costin. Nice. This is uh, your powerful rare card that summons your Dark Magician with two Dark Tributes. Um, Kaiser Seahorse. Is that the guy that this is comparable to? Kind of the opposite. Blessings of the Nile. There we go. Legendary Jiu-Jitsu Master, Beckoning Light. Actually, a powerful card used in light decks for quite long, quite long time. And Vampire Lady. Never really found her way, but still. Cool picture. All right, there's Ancient Sanctuary. We are halfway done. This is the halfway point. We've opened up three separate booster packs. Oh, we didn't talk about Blowback Dragon, though. This is Bandit Keith all the way. Blowback Dragon, Secret Rare, also an Ultra Rare, I believe. Ancient Sanctuary. Toss three coins. At least two results are heads. Destroy one card your opponent's side of the field. Once per turn during the main phase. Beautiful. Blow back freaking dragon. Look at that ring of destruction over there. Are you kidding me? That's amazing. That is amazing. All right. Let's get into Dark Crisis, guys. And then we'll go Magician's Force, Invasion of Chaos. We'll end on Magician's Force, I guess. Um, Invasion of Chaos, my favorite set. Magician's Force, definitely up there, though, with the... Uh, Dark Magician Girl. Holy crap if we pull a Dark Magician Girl. That's crazy. All right, next pack. Here we go. This is Dark Crisis. I've actually, have I ever pulled Exodia Necros on video for you guys? I feel like we've searched for him many a time, but I still, we've still not been able to pull him. We'll talk about Exodia Necros after this. Ga, Ga, Gigo. Can we get a foil? Non-spellcasting area. Ray of Hope. Nin Ken Dog. No! Ultra Rare Guardian Graral! Yes! You guys, what is this nonsense? An Ultra and a Secret out of five packs and it's, oh my gosh, so old. Oh, I love it. Guys, we're talking almost 20 years ago. You kidding me? This is definitely over 15-year-old cards. This is... This is the stuff, guys. This is Yu-Gi-Oh! right here. Guardian Graral. Man, I don't even know the last time I pulled this guy. It can only be normal summon, flip summon, or special summon if there's Gravity Axe Graral on your side of the field. What's Which is funny, Gravity Axe Graral was one of the better cards in like Duel Links and Speed Duels in the beginning, by the way. Because um, it doesn't let them change their position. If this is the only card in your hand, you can special summon it without offering a tribute. Wow. Dinosaur, by the way, if you guys are trying to find a dinosaur for your dino deck, maybe consider Guardian Grar. Cool. Love it. Man, you guys, this is so, just to remind you, when you see us opening like Legendary Collection, that, those packs are the 2010 versions of these packs. These are 2003 or 4 versions. This is crazy, guys. This is classic. This is Yu-Gi-Oh! So that is another giveaway winner right there. Holy crap, ultra rare. Yes, that could have been Exodia Necros, one of the best pulls possible, but we still do have our secret Exodia Necros here. Gorgeous card. When is the last time you looked at this guy's effect, guys? Cannot be normal summon to set, can only be special summon with the effect of contract. So you do have to use contract with the Exodia for this. It's one of the few like ritual type effects where it's not a ritual monster. Um, this card does not destroy result of battle or card effects. And uh, oh, it says each card type there, that's funny. 
And then during each of your standby phases, increase the attack of this card by 500 points. This card is destroyed when any Exodia the Forbidden One piece is not in your grave. Quite easy to do now. It's just that there's so many cards that like don't target and remove cards from the field. It's still pretty cool. Back in the day, guys, I would always try to pull out an Exodia Necross. Probably have to use Painful Choice. Another very, very banned card there. Wow. All right, guys, we are in the realm of the gods already. We still have two of the booster, best booster packs in the history of Yu-Gi-Oh! Invasion of Chaos, having that Black Luster Soldier, um, and Envoy the End, and Envoy the Beginning. But also, you guys, Dark Magician of Chaos. I mean, Dark Magician of Chaos is in here. He's on the freaking pack. Hopefully, I can pull it. Hopefully, we can pull it. Uh, this is this is nuts. This is nuts. I cannot believe how amazing this is. Just real quick, let's maybe call upon our Black Luster Soldier pull here. Oh my gosh, look at that guy. All right, we'll talk about his effect in a second. This is Invasion of Chaos, my favorite set. Hopefully I can pull something for you. Here we go. I'm gonna have to take a whiff of this one, guys. This is it. Oh, Invasion of Chaos, yes! Oh my god. Can we get a foil? Ojama Black, blasting the roots. Speaking of Ojama Black, I believe there's new Ojamas coming out soon. Neo Bug, Salvage, love it. Berserk. Gorilla, oh my gosh, my man. Um, I used to love me some Beast Beatdown back in the day. Back in the day, 2005. Was that when you went in tournaments with Beast Beatdown? I might have got second place. It's okay. Um, but I was beating Chaos decks. That's right. Whoa. So Berserk Gorilla going Berserk there for a second. That's crazy. Crazy card. 2000 attack, four star. It's funny, I expected this to be in the Beast deck um, in the, uh, the reprint Battle City God Box there that we were talking about in the beginning of the video. But um, he was not. Probably a little too good with 2010. Berserk Gorilla, love it, love it. Cannon Ball Spear Shellfish, DD Borderline, and Ojama, oh, double Ojama, but a Balloon Lizard. Two Ojamas though. Nice. Wowie guys. Wow. Berserk Gorilla. It's crazy. Chaos, one of my favorite archetypes. Beast, one of my favorite archetypes from back in the day. I love it. Black Luster Soldier, Envoy the Beginning, though, guys. This is the man, the myth, the legend. And my God, that is some great borders. Oh, man, this might actually be a graded 10. Wow. All right, you guys know this effect? We'll read it. This is a classic. Can only be special by removing light and dark monster in your grave from play. Once during each of your turns, you can select and activate one of the following effects. Remove one monster on the field from play. Wow. Cannot attack the turn you activate this. That's a great effect. If this card destroyed opponent's monster, result of battle, it can attack again once in a row. Holy waka freaking moly. The game ender. The man. Blacklister Soldier Envoy the beginning. Is this guy unlimited yet? That's how broken Yu-Gi-Oh is right now. It's just so broken. I feel like you can have three of those in your deck. It still won't be that good. Back in the day, though, man. Woo! Black Luster Soldier. All right, you guys, we're getting to the final pack of Destiny for this opening. This has been one of the most fantastic experiences we've done together in a while. Um, remember, you guys, we are doing a giveaway for this video. All that you got to do is give this video a thumbs up, post in the comments below. I mean, I'd appreciate it if you were subscribed, but um, yeah, post in the comments below. Which master collection, volume one or two, TCG, obviously English, um, you prefer and why. Um, this is gonna be crazy. This is it, this is it. And we have six winners today. We're about to open Magician's Force. This is truly one of the, ra the rarest unlimited booster packs just because it has so little prints, so few prints. Um, so very excited for this. We'll be opening up a little bit more after this if you guys wanna stick around. Just unbelievable opening. This is Master Collection. This is Volume 2. Here we go. Last pack of Destiny. Give it to us. Kaiba! We can actually pull a Dark Magician Girl. We've seen the Ring of Destruction. We've seen it happen. 
There's Dark Paladin in here. So much greatness. Here we go. This is Magician's Force. Gather your mind. Pigeon holding books of spell, also renamed to have Spellbook in the title. Thunder Ruler. Come on, baby. D Motion. <laughs> of all the cards to pull, Cat's Ear Tribe. <laughs> oh man, this card. How, how did you, there's a combo with this. During the damage step of your opponent's turn, the original attack of his or her monsters that attack has become 200. That's hilarious. So the way to play this was you could just throw an equipment on it, and then that way you could just block your opponent's attacks. Or you could use cards like reinforcements, right? Um, 500 attack, destroy your opponent's monster as they attack into this. Funny. Cat's Ear Tribe, and it is a Beast Warrior, so it kind of did fit in the Beast deck, but I never really used it. Oh, it also worked with Gaia Power, I guess, 500. Poison the Old Man, that's actually quite a really good spell. Interesting, Oppressed People, Aitsu, and Dark Cat with a white tail. Interesting, all the monsters at the end there. Um, interesting though, very cool. Magician's Force, you guys. Last pack of Destiny there. Gather your mind. Got the pigeon holding, pigeon holding spell book. Cat's ear tribe. What a pack! What a pack! All right, guys. That is our six booster packs. We'll be giving each of those away once again. Six different winners. Um, we'll be reaching out to those in the comments below. Um, we'll have a similar type of video coming out, um, hopefully sooner than later, and we can announce those who won. <sighs> Crazy guys. All right. I'm gonna leave this in the background. We have a couple more products we'll be opening up today. All right, you guys, found one of these and I thought it'd be a great time to pop it open. Give us another chance at some of these classic cards. And it is the Duelist Saga first edition box here. Um, new cards from every TV show. The Blue Ice Pack, the Yugi there. So thought maybe, just maybe we can try to pull some, some, classes, some classic new ultra rare technology cards here while I have you guys for this video. Duelist Saga box. All new ultra rare technology. Unbelievable guys, master collection. That was fan fantastic. Oh man, Duelist Saga, here we go. From this set, you got Black Lester Soldier, Envoy of the Beginning, there he is. You got Blue Eyes, um, actually, from this set, Graded Blue Eyes is worth quite a bit. Um, we got Dark Magician in here. Um, lots of cool cards, actually. Lots of cool cards. We'll start with Zane's Cyber Dragon Pack. Here we go. This is Duelist Saga. Hey, that's a good start. Pot of Duality. Beautiful card there. Look at that. Wow. Cyber Dragon from the Cyber Dragon Pack. That's nice. Not always expected, but always welcomed. Dark Summoning Beast, there we go. One of those crazy Demon God cards. Debound Colonel, nice. And the Double Star Shaman. Very cool, guys. Classic cards there, Pot of Duality and Cyber Dragon, always been very powerful cards. Okay, next pack we got Yugi Boy. Can we pull? Oh man, we got a demon god. Hammond, Lord of Striking Thunder. And you guys think, oh, this is actually, you know, not gonna be too valuable because it's already been printed. So this is actually pretty valuable. This is a new ultra rare technology version, first edition of a demon god. So I just wanna let you guys know this actually holds value. Very nice. Dimension Fissure, Dark Lords, Descent, Hey, Honest Neos, nice. Actually, pretty sweet pool. That ultra rare technology. I really like that picture too. Very nice. He's got foil on the, yes, he does have foil on the red on his body, nice. 
And Vision Hero Vion, nice two hero cards that are worth something there. That's pretty cool. Nice hero pack. All right. And last but not least, we do have a Cyber Dragon pack here, trying to end strong. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. First edition. Here we go. Oh. Speaking of classic cards, we have a Suki Omi. What? I love it. Suki Omi, guys. Classics. Let's go from the back this time. I just want to see. We got a double fin shark. Number Titanics. And contracts. Okay. I think it's two classic cards in the front. That's how these packs work. These packs work. And what do we got? Oh, we got a fusion. We got a fusion. Armatile. Oh, man. Here we go. Oh, come here to that Fortress Dragon. That's a good pull, though. Wow. Ooh. That is sweet. Come here, attack. Fortress Dragon. Uh, Cyber Dragons were just too good, so Konami had to come out with a card that allowed you to throw a Cyber Dragon in your deck and start fusing with your opponent's Cyber Dragon. That was funny. Side deck. One of the best side deck cards in classic Yu-Gi-Oh. Now you're not going to see it anymore, of course, but just still, it was pretty cool at the time. Hey, man, I'm going to use Cyber Dragon. It's a pretty cool card. Why? So then I can just fuse my opponent's machines. Oh. <laughs> Very cool, guys. All right, you guys. Let's end strong in this already godly video. Um, again, pulling them classic cards, especially Secret Rare Ring of Destruction. You can see it over there. Um, and then, of course, the Ultra Rare from Dark Crisis. For this godly video, I thought we would end strong with some god packs. Some of you guys say god packs. What do we mean with god packs? We have the Obelisk, the Tormentor booster pack. We have the Wing Dragon of Raw booster pack and Slifer, the Sky Dragon. Honestly, I love these packs. Um, this is Battle Pack 2, War of the Giants. It's one of my favorite sets. I feel like we made dual videos with this so many times back in the day when I could get Alex on the show. Um, haven't been able to do that recently, but we've been working on uh, kind of putting together a studio here. And so once we have that all set up, I feel like we'll have a chance at some dual videos again. And man, would I love to do some battle pack videos. Um, this is the God card pack. One of the original, the original playable God cards, I believe came from here. Um, there might've been an if for butts there with some of the other reprints, but still, this is kind of the OG original playable God cards. If we pull one right now, that'd be pretty crazy. It's about one in 75, 100 packs. They're kind of hard to pull. Um, they only come Starlight Foil, so um, or Shattered Mosaic Foil, whatever it is. Hopefully, we can pull one for you guys, and that'd be crazy. Let's do this. We'll start with the Winged Dragon Overall. So many classic cards in here, too. That's why I love it. We got a Wabaku to start off. Powerful card there. I love me some Wabaku. Got a Winged Rhinos, originally only coming in the uh, special, super special edition. We got Bull Blader, so that, by the way, this was your Mosaic, I think, foil? Something like that. And then this is your uh, rare black, black rare foil. See that there on the name? An Axe Dragonut. Oh, with a Tiki Soul. All right. Two more packs. Come on, this is the God Pack. Let's go, baby. Slifer the Sky Dragon. Here we go. I mean, is it going to be the second every time? I feel like it changes up. We'll just throw the two right there in the back. All right. Horn of the Unicorn. Nice. Classic Yugi. Drill Roy. Autonomous Action Unit. Magician's Force. Zolga. All right. I think that's a Taya card, actually. Or is it Shizu? I think maybe it's a Shizu. Zolga. And Shard of Greed. At least at least we got a piece of the Pot of Greed. So what does Shard of Greed do? It draws you just half a card. <laughs> All right, last pack of Destiny. This is it for this opening, guys. This is our God Pack. Finishing strong on an Obelisk the Tormentor. And yes, I wanted to finish on a pack where we could say, Give it to us! Kaiba! Let me throw those two in the back. Can we pull an epic card? Here we go. Ego boost. We're gonna boost our ego. Copycat, love that card. Very nice. Classic. Sinister Seeds. Dark Valkyria. Not a Val Valkyrie, it's a Valkyria. And Memory of the Adversary. 
That is a cool card right there. Very cool. All right, you guys, that is everything. Remember to check out the links at the top of the description below. This was a Master Collection Volume 2 opening with some fun openings at the end, guys. Giving away all six of our booster packs. Remember, very simple to enter the giveaway. Just like the video. Be sure you're subscribed. And, of course, post in the comments below which is your favorite Volume 1 or Volume 2 Master Collection TCG. But, yeah, you guys, this was amazing. This was awesome. And simply unlucky signing out. Mm -hmm.